Hi. Welcome to VC School of English. I am your PTE doctor. We are providing one on one PTA coaching. After enrolling our courses, you will get Kentness latest study material along with extended support for next four months. Hey guys, welcome to VC School of English. In today's lecture, we are going to do summarize written text. So in today's lecture, I am going to teach you some ninja techniques to deal with summarized written text. Generally, in summarized written text, we find difficulty to write it without grammar errors. However, with our ninja templates, you can overcome this problem. So let's begin. Here are some important key points which we have to take care of while doing summarized written text. The very first one is number of tasks. In PT, we will get one or two number of questions followed by words limit. So there will be words limit between 5 to 75 words. And the third one is skills involved in this task. There are two numbers of skills involved in this task, such as reading and writing. The fourth one is scoring. So you will get five points for writing and five points for reading. Let's talk about time to finish the task. So you will get 10 minutes to perform the task, but we have to finish the task in five minutes of proofwriting and two minutes of proofreading. As proofreading is very important when you are doing summarized written text, because generally in summarized written text, students do typo errors. They aren't doing it deliberately, but while doing it may happen accidentally. So to overcome this problem, we need to do proofreading. So now let's learn secret tips to eliminate the grammar errors. The first one is always look for a plural noun as plural noun doesn't require articles. If a singular noun is important, then convert it into a plural noun. For example, child into children. Followed by, if you pick a verb plus noun combination, then convert it into ing or v for form. For example, eat into eating. The third one is always put an article before and after the noun if it pairs with of. For example, parts of plants into the parts of plants. Here in this example, you can see uh, before parts of plants, we have placed articles. And the fourth one is use articles before the combination of adjective plus noun or common noun plus proper noun or proper noun plus common noun. For example, best sorts of fibers into the best sources of fiber. So in this example, you can see that before best sources of fiber, we have placed article the. In the next example, we have a combination of proper noun plus common noun. So in this example, you can see we have placed article before the, uh, uh, article the before Apollo Hospital. Let's find out the benefits of using the template and strategies. It will enrich with good content followed by zero grammar error and it is an well-structured template. Here is the template for your use. Let's do an exercise by using this template. But before doing so, please do not forget to subscribe, like, share our YouTube channel to get more PT related updates. So now let's learn how to pick keywords from the paragraph. Initially, I'm going to pick plural noun followed by verb plus noun combination. Always remember my dear friends, whenever you are going to pick the keywords, you should pick the keywords from each of the paragraphs. At least two or three keywords you need to pick from the paragraph. So let's move to the next paragraph. In this paragraph, I'm going to pick this keyword because it's a it's in plural form. It's a plural noun, basically. Followed by the next keyword is should be. Let me have a look. Which keyword is important? Uh, grocery stores. So I am picking those keywords as per my interest, and you guys uh, can pick the keywords as per your uh, wish. It is not necessary that uh, we need to pick, uh, pick the keywords as I am picking the keywords. But whenever you are uh, picking the keywords, the keyword combination should be plural noun and verb plus noun combination. And if you are picking uh, keywords that needs to be 
a combination of uh, adjective plus noun. So always look for article before that. So this is the fifth keyword. This is the sixth keywords because as per as per our template, we need to pick seven keywords at least to fulfill the requirement. If you want to pick more keywords, you can pick these type of keywords. Whenever you're picking such keywords, always remember, my dear friends, these keywords need, uh, if these keywords are uh, with uh, double quotes or single quotes, always pick those keywords because those keywords are very important in the paragraph. So let's pick last keywords. This is also a combination of verb plus noun. Now, uh, there is a one caution for you because here I am, uh, I can highlight the keywords because I am using third party applications. But in Pearson exam, you cannot copy or uh, you cannot select the keywords. So you have to for uh, you have to type for the same. So you have to type. So now I'm going to type the keywords. So my first keyword is Americans followed by the next keyword is eat eat about 16 gram of fibers so now i'm going to convert eat into eating because i uh, previously i have mentioned that whenever you're picking the verbs the verb needs to be converted into ing form so eating about 16 grams of fiber followed by the next keyword is fast food marketing to agri culture sub series the next one is grocery stores grocery stores and the best sources of fiber as uh, as this keyword is the combination of adjective plus noun so that's why we are putting or placing article before the noun the next keyword is uh, double quotes the sorry uh, unprocessed Foods and veggie tables. The last one is prefer, prefer into preferring mushy, comma, fiber, free, comfort. Now let's take a look how many how many in the words we have picked so far. So number of keywords are 50. So we have picked 50 number of keywords so far. So I just wanted to add one more because uh, uh, this one I have selected. So which is very important uh, in this context. So I'm going to put it here. Comma. The case of that. That's it. So, uh, when we are writing summary, so we need to put uh, like uh, the, 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 the number of words should be between 50, uh, uh, 55 to 60 keywords. So, now we are almost uh, nearby. 54 keywords so that's enough now i'm going to submit and let's check out the score and how much score we are getting by using this strategy as well as template Tada! so see we got perfect seven out of seven points